Next, NASA says its Voyager 1 probe, the most distant human-made object in the universe, is sending usable information to Earth again. Something strange happened to Voyager 1, the spacecraft that has been exploring the edges of our solar system since 1977. On December 12, 2023, the probe, which has ventured farther than any other human-made object, suddenly began transmitting data that made no sense. NASA was expecting its usual stream of vital information, but instead, it received jumbled binary code, just ones and zeros that had no meaning. It was as if the spacecraft, after more than 45 years of successful communication, had suddenly gone rogue. NASA engineers scrambled to fix the issue, sending commands to the probe. And while Voyager 1 responded, its data remained utter gibberish. The first attempt to restart the flight system didn't work. Days turned into weeks, and the situation became even more dire. What was once a reliable source of groundbreaking information now seemed like it was slipping through NASA's fingers. And with each failed fix, the question loomed larger. Could this be more than just a technical glitch? Could something or someone be interfering with the spacecraft? The urgency grew as engineers worked around the clock, trying everything they could think of to bring Voyager 1 back to normal. Months of trial and error provided few answers. Finally, a potential solution emerged, offering a flicker of hope. The agency later said it had found the source of the garbled information, a zombie computer that should not have been used to relay telemetry data. While NASA engineers have solved the problem, they still don't know why the AACS started routing information through the non-functioning computer. However, they guess that the AACS probably received a faulty command from another onboard computer or maybe something far more mysterious. Now, one unsettling thought has persisted. Was this just a malfunction, or were we on the brink of discovering something far more mysterious? Science fiction often paints a dramatic picture of space exploration, where humanity encounters mysterious and possibly hostile forces. Films like Independence Day, War of the Worlds, and a rival show alien technology posing serious threats to our survival. Now, with Voyager 1's recent malfunction, some wonder if an alien encounter could be behind its strange behavior. This spacecraft, which has been journeying through the vastness of space since 1977, carries the golden record, a time capsule with Earth's messages, sounds, and images meant to represent us to any potential extraterrestrial life. If an alien civilization were to discover Voyager 1, they'd gain a window into our culture, technology, and the rich diversity of life on Earth. Such a revelation could lead to a deep and possibly dangerous understanding of humanity. The idea that aliens might perceive this information as either a threat or an intriguing puzzle raises chilling questions about the risks of sending such probes into the unknown. Yet, despite these sci-fi scenarios, space exploration is fundamentally about our quest for knowledge and discovery. NASA's missions aren't just about answering monumental questions about our origins or whether we're alone in the universe. From inspiring new generations of scientists to fostering international cooperation, space exploration has led to incredible technological breakthroughs. Projects like the International Space Station, involving agencies from 15 countries, and the Artemis Accords, supported by 24 nations for lunar exploration, showcase the global spirit behind our pursuit of the cosmos. Now, Voyager 1's mission has been nothing short of revolutionary. Since its launch, the spacecraft has dramatically expanded our knowledge of the solar system. One of its most groundbreaking discoveries was revealing Jupiter's moon Io 
as a volcanic hotspot, shattering the old notion of it being just another barren rock. With its intense volcanic activity, Io stands out as the most geologically dynamic body in the solar system, capturing the imagination of scientists who are eager to understand its fiery surface. Voyager 1 also delivered stunning images of Saturn, showcasing its majestic rings with unprecedented clarity. Its observations of Titan, Saturn's largest moon, suggested the presence of liquid water, igniting hopes that this distant world might harbor the conditions necessary for life. Each of these revelations has not only deepened our grasp of the solar system, but also set the stage for future exploration. Yet, Voyager 1's current issues are not a first in the annals of space exploration. Similar challenges have plagued other missions, highlighting the difficulties of keeping communication with probes so far from Earth. Take the case of NASA's Mars rover Opportunity, which lost contact in June 2018 due to a colossal dust storm. This storm, spanning an area larger than Africa, blocked sunlight from reaching Opportunity's solar panels, cutting off its power and halting communication. Despite its mission exceeding all expectations and its crucial discoveries about water on Mars, the rover remained silent for months. NASA's efforts, including sending commands and even playing music in an attempt to revive the rover, met with no response, underscoring the unpredictable nature of space exploration. The uncertainty surrounding the fate of NASA's Mars rover Opportunity left many wondering if it would ever communicate with Earth again. Opportunity's silence served as a stark reminder of the harsh and unpredictable conditions spacecraft face in space. Mars dust storms can be colossal, towering 20 to 30 kilometers high and lasting weeks or even months. These storms can coat the atmosphere, making it nearly impossible for solar-powered rovers like Opportunity to recharge. Despite the rover's previous durability, the 2018 dust storm highlighted the difficulties of managing long-term missions on distant planets. Despite the initial worries about Voyager 1's issues, its legacy remains intact. Its groundbreaking discoveries and pioneering role in space exploration will continue to inspire future generations. Similarly, Opportunity's mission officially ended on February 13, 2019, after repeated attempts to contact it failed. Though Opportunity did not respond to over 1,000 signals sent since August 2018, its extraordinary achievements and the questions it leaves behind resonate across the vastness of space. Now there is another mystery at play surrounding these probes. On November 5, 2018, NASA's Voyager 2 spacecraft crossed into interstellar space, following in the footsteps of its twin, Voyager 1. But as Voyager 2 ventured into the cosmic unknown, it stumbled upon something its predecessor missed entirely. For the past few months, scientists have been digging into the data Voyager 2 collected as it journeyed from the sun's influence into the interstellar medium, the vast emptiness between stars. This transition occurs at the heliopause, a turbulent boundary where high-energy particles from distant stars collide with the sun's protective magnetic bubble. Interestingly, Voyager 1 might have encountered a similar boundary layer, but it was positioned inside the heliopause. Stone explains that there seems to be cosmic ray boundary layers on both sides of the heliopause, with the outer one only appearing where Voyager 2 crossed. This layer was not visible to Voyager 1 at the time of its transition. But what caused this discrepancy? The answer might lie in their different paths. Voyager 1 exited the heliopause in the Northern Hemisphere, while Voyager 2 did so from the Southern Hemisphere. Moreover, 
The environment at the edge of interstellar space is constantly shifting. In the six years between the two probes' journeys, the sun's activity had waned, affecting the conditions each spacecraft encountered. Voyager 1 recorded a surge of high-energy cosmic rays even before it crossed the heliopause. As Edward Stone explains, we had two episodes where we were connected to the outside. We saw the leakage from outside in. On the flip side, Voyager 2 experienced an uptick in low-energy particles from the heliosphere once it ventured into interstellar space. These findings reveal the perplexing nature of the heliopause, a boundary that seems both impenetrable and oddly permeable. Most cosmic rays still struggle to penetrate this shield, which is crucial for life on Earth, because galactic cosmic radiation can be harmful to living organisms. Understanding these cosmic boundaries could help scientists identify potentially habitable star systems and exoplanets beyond our solar system. If this deep dive into space left you craving more, click the link on your screen to explore further content. See you there.